about when the George Floyd thing happened, I was getting really frustrated about, I was getting really frustrated about like why so many people were now seeing this George Floyd as different when Omar Arbery happened two weeks ago. It's been carnage after carnage after carnage and I was upset about it. And so I reached out to the artist Matt Lively and had a conversation with him who had a totally different viewpoint on it than I, I did. He was telling me like why it was different to him. And it really, it gave me some hope and it really like made me think of doing something different. We could bring together artists that, you know, know of each other maybe, but don't know each other. And artists who would not normally be paired together could come together and create these public art pieces that center around empathy and connection. And that is how Many Walls was born. The Juneteenth installation with the We Need to Talk stencils um, in downtown Richmond uh, to start the Mending Walls project was really encouraging having all of those artists really believe in the project um, and really believe in the message, the We Need to Talk message. It's based on your understanding, your empathy, yeah. you know what I'm saying, understanding what's what we what are we fighting for? What's the goal? What's the end what's the end goal? Like and, and being able to articulate it and guide and teach. We came together and we had those tough talks. Before we talked art, before we talked anything, we talked family. I got a chance to get to know him. The fact that we have daughters that are almost the same age. And it was like, well, what do we want to tell them? Or what do we want them to take from this conversation or from this shift in, in so social justice moment? I see public art as a way to have a greater conversation. And that's what this project is about. I'm looking back at all of the work. I was just in awe. This project is way bigger than anything that I could have dreamed of. There's no way that I could have made Mending Walls what it is without all of the artists' help and the community members who played a part in the talks and donated their walls. This was something that uh, the whole community contributed to that a mural is worth a thousand words. Yeah. This is an incredible gift to our community. I think the Mending Walls Project shows Richmond's willingness for progress. We are a super creative city that um, goes above and beyond to include. And I think we are going to continue having more projects like this that really speak to the identity of Richmond.